Hello, everyone. It is an honor to share with you our team's perspectives and insights on the combined detection of inflammatory proteins is beneficial for diagnosing the papillary thyroid carcinoma and nodular goiter. Thyroid cancer, the most common endocrine malignancy, has seen a significant increase in its incidence rate since 200. However, the mortality rate has remained relatively stable during the same period. Fine needle aspiration cytology and imaging examinations are commonly used diagnostic tools for PTC in clinical practice. However, it is an invasive procedure that carries the risk of severe complications and has a non-diagnostic rate of about 10% 20%. There is a positive correlation between chronic inflammation and the increased risk of thyroid cancer. However, there remains some uncertainty surrounding the expression profile of these inflammatory proteins in thyroid cancer. Proximity extension assays exhibit high specificity, sensitivity, and detection throughput, making it an attractive option for detecting PTC biomarkers. This study aimed to evaluate the broad expression of inflammatory proteins in the serums of patients with PTC. Total 36 differentially expressed inflammatory proteins were found among PTC, nodular goiter, and healthy control. TGF-alpha plus CXCL11 exhibited promising diagnostic capabilities. In distinguishing nodular goiter from healthy control, TGF-alpha plus CXCL11 exhibited promising diagnostic capabilities in distinguishing PTC from healthy control. GDNF plus CXCL5 plus ARTN demonstrated optimal diagnostic effectiveness in distinguishing PTC from nodular goiter. The combination derived from the LASSO algorithm outperforms logistic regression, albeit with a higher number of proteins. Differences in inflammatory proteins among healthy controls, nodular goiters, and PTC. Total 36 differentially expressed inflammatory proteins were found among PTC, nodular goiters, and healthy controls. Inflammatory biomarkers of different proteins were investigated for diagnosing nodular goiter from healthy controls. Diagnosing PTC from the healthy controls and diagnosing PTC from nodular goiter, these results indicated that TGF-alpha plus CXCL11 exhibited promising diagnostic capabilities in distinguishing nodular goiter from healthy control. TGF-alpha plus CXCL11 exhibited promising diagnostic capabilities in distinguishing PTC from healthy control. GDNF plus CXCL5ARTN demonstrated optimal diagnostic effectiveness in distinguishing nodular goiter. A diagnostic marker for thyroid cancer was developed using the least absolute shrinkage and selection operator LASSO algorithm. These results indicated that the combination of six proteins exhibited promising diagnostic capabilities in distinguishing nodular goiter from healthy control. The combination of five proteins exhibited promising diagnostic capabilities in distinguishing PTC from healthy control. The combination of eight proteins exhibited promising diagnostic capabilities in distinguishing PTC from nodular goiter. The expression of main differences in inflammatory proteins among 14 proteins. 10 proteins in nodular goiter exhibited significant elevations compared to the healthy control group. 10 proteins in PTC demonstrated significant elevations. Additionally, CXCL5 and ARTN proteins experienced notable decreases in the PTC group compared to the nodular goiter group. This study offers potential biomarkers for distinguishing between PTC and nodular goiter in clinical practice, thereby aiding in developing treatment strategies and mitigating overtreatment. Furthermore, compared to logistic regression, the results from the LASSO algorithm demonstrate better diagnostic efficacy, albeit requiring more protein combinations. This implies that while the LASSO algorithm yields superior diagnostic outcomes, it also entails higher costs. Therefore, further research is needed to strike a balance between diagnostic accuracy and healthcare expenditure. Thank you for your listening.